Forge for Minecraft 1.21.1. Let's go ahead and get it. First things first, you want to go here. This is the second link in the description down below. And this is our in-depth text guide on getting Forge. It goes over everything you want to know in a text format. If you prefer text guides, well, here it is. Otherwise, everything's covered in this video guide as well. On this page, go ahead and click the yellow download button to go to Forge's official download page. On this page, you want to select 1.21 on the left-hand side and then 1.21.1. From there, under Download Latest here, go ahead and click on Installer, and that will take you off to Add Focus for Stop! Don't click anything on this page whatsoever. Just put your hands in the air and wait about 10 seconds. After about 10 seconds, a skip button, a red skip button up here in the top right will appear. Click on that skip button, and when you do, it will prompt you to download Forge. As long as Forge is in the title, which it is here, you are safe to keep or save this file. While Forge is downloading, how much from our company, Simple Game Hosting? Go to the first link in the description down below, the breakdown, that XYZ says SGH, to your very own 24-hour DDoS protected Minecraft server for you and your friends. You can easily add mods, plugins, or mod packs to your server, including Forge mods and mod packs, and customize your server any way that you want. Plus, there's expert live chat support there to help you out if you have any issues along the way. So stop struggling to host a Minecraft server and host your Minecraft server the simple way at the first link in the description down below, breakdown.xyz slash sgh. Nevertheless, we can now go ahead and minimize our browser, and we want to move the Forge file we downloaded from our downloads folder here to our desktop, just because it's going to be easier to use it from our desktop. What you then want to do is right click on Forge, click on Open With, click Java, and click OK. But what if you don't have Java here? What if you do? You click Java, you click OK, and it doesn't work. Well, in both of those scenarios, you need to get Java 21. As a Minecraft 1.21, you need Java 21. So we have a guide in the description down below that goes over exactly how to get Java 21 for Minecraft mods, like Forge. This covers everything. After you've gotten Java 21, you may need to run the jar fix. This is going to take all your jar files like Forge, and link them back to Java, making them work happily together. Nonetheless, at this point, we go ahead and minimize our browser and install Forge by right-clicking on it, clicking Open With, clicking Java, and clicking OK. Now, once you're in the Forge installer, just click on Install Client, click OK, and it will now install. The only reason this would fail is if you've never played Minecraft 1.21.1 before, or if your Minecraft or Minecraft Launcher are open. You want to make sure both of those are closed. Once Forge is successfully installed, you'll see this. Successfully installed Client Profile Forge. Awesome. Click OK. It will close out of that, and now we can delete Forge. At this point, you can actually play Minecraft with Forge. To do that, all you've got to do is open up your Minecraft Launcher. Then, in the Minecraft Launcher, what we want to do is go ahead ahead and click on installations up here at the top. Then you want to make sure modded is selected. As you can see, if modded is not there, Forge is there. But if you select modded, there's Forge. And now, as long as it's Forge 1.21.1, you're going to go ahead and play Minecraft with this installation. But if you don't have Forge here, and it specifically don't have Forge 1.21.1, go ahead and click new installation. You can name it anything you want. I'm going to name it simplegamehosting.com because that's the easiest way to play Minecraft with your friends. And then go ahead and click the versions drop down box here. Then you want to select release 1.21.1-forge. Right here it is. Click on that, and then I'm going to change the resolution so we can see better and click create. Now all you got to do to play Minecraft with the Forge is either play it with the installation that was created or the one that was there by default. It's up to you. And then whenever we go ahead and play Minecraft, it will open with Forge 1.21.1 installed. But you probably want to add some mods. Well, luckily we in the description down below, we have links to where you can get Minecraft mods. Specifically, Curse Forge and Moderinth are both the most popular places to get Minecraft mods. Mods. Just make sure when you're downloading mods that you're using Forge, not Neo Forge. Neo Forge mods will not work with Minecraft Forge. So you want to make sure that you're selecting in your mod loader here, Forge, and they all need to be for 1.21.1. So as you can see, all of these mods here would work. Just enough items, Journey Map, Waystones, any of these mods that you want. And then on Modern, the same thing. You want to make sure you're installing Forge or getting Forge mods for 1.21.1. And in this case, all of these mods would work here. So once you've got your mods, how do you install them? Well, it's actually really easy. Just drag and drop them into your mods folder. To do that, go into mods here and then click open mods folder in the bottom left. Again, that was from the main menu. Click mods and then open mods folder in the bottom left and then drag and drop any mods you want right here into your mods folder. Once you do that, they will be active in game after restarting Minecraft. It's also worth noting you have to play Minecraft with Forge in order for your mods to work. At that point, you're good to go, and they are installed. Should you have any issues with Minecraft mods, we've got this. This is a guide on how to fix broken Minecraft mods. It goes in-depth on fixing broken Minecraft mods. Step-by-step, step, 20 minutes of me fixing stuff with Minecraft mods, and it's super helpful. Helped over 300 or nearly 300,000 people. Nevertheless, you now know how to get Forge in Minecraft 1.21.1. If this video helped you out, give it a thumbs up and subscribe. We'll see you in the next one. I'm out. Peace.